Hello, I'm Rancho Palos Verdes City Manager R. Moranian with an update from the October 15th City Council meeting. The City Council took action on a number of issues related to the landslide, the Civic Center Master Plan Project, and wireless telecommunications coverage. The Council voted to continue working on the Portuguese Bend Landslide Emergency Project as the effects of the ongoing land movement continue to be felt in the Greater Portuguese Bend Ancient Altamira Landslide Complex. In recent weeks, the installation of six vertical dewatering wells west of the Portuguese Beach Club has helped slow the slide and resulted in removing more than 550 gallons of water per minute. Installation of a seventh dewatering well is expected to be completed this week and crews are mobilizing for winterization efforts in various canyons and neighborhoods impacted by the slide. While the landslide remains the top priority, the Council also navigated the revised Civic Center Master Plan project. The Council directed staff to onboard a project manager to complete FEMA-required emergency and public safety components of the plan. For years, the City Council, Civic Center Advisory Committee, and community members have been working on the master planning process for building a new Civic Center campus to replace the aging facilities. Staff will return to the Council in six months with a project update and timeline. Meanwhile, the Council received an update on the latest efforts to improve wireless cell service and install more wireless telecommunication facilities on public and private sites throughout the city. The Council directed staff to meet with the various carriers and cellular telecommunications lobbying firm to investigate potential code amendments and ways to incentivize carriers to improve cell coverage. The Council received input from concerned residents, first responders, and telecommunication representatives about the lack of cell reception and the need for more reliable service. Staff will return to the Council within the next four months with an update and potential solutions. For more details on all the issues before the City Council, watch the meeting on RPV TV or the City's website at rpvca.gov. Let's stay connected and remember, we are RPV together.